everybody, today we're going to look at yeah, the trash pack scrap braces. Yeah. If he'd be a pie. Okay, so we found these in Kmart. Kmart. And we, I wanted to show you Charming Jack Skeleton from Jack Milkers. Jack, Jack, Mom. Jack, Jack. Trash pack biters. They can open their mouths yeah. and, open and they You'll can bite that. on your pink fingers. See? This looks fun and this is rubbish. You can race. Let's do it! Well, Open them! Come on! Yeah, okay. Ah, uh, uh, ow. Da, 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 we. And this one. So it's got a bin and a butter. With a pair of underwear. Hey guys, you get two exclusive trashies. Flappy Patty, Flappy Patty. What's a Flappy Patty got to do with this? Yeah. The underwear yeah. of truth. Oh, oh yeah! Yeah, I got the butter. I got the butter. Last one, it's all wrapped up in this. They come with a little launcher and I'll put this launcher into this bin and then they launch off like that. Hey, let's do the other one. Three, two, one, go. We're gonna open the rest. Yeah. Okay, so this comes with a toilet and a shoe Ooh. with a bug on it. Do we really need the toilet yeah. as yeah, a toy? A... Uh, but Dad, toilet toys are really cool. I'm sure yeah. you'll learn that. No. Oh, oh yay. Oh, this is up. Wait a second, wait a second. They come with the same launches. This is my favorite trashy. What is it? I can't. I think it's poo. <laughs> it's poo meant to go in the toilet. It's brown. <laughs> it's brown. It should. And so this, this really is YouTube poop. <laughs> no wonder they have toilet roll and it's like toilet paper on it and this thing stuck to its head. <laughs> and it's brown and bumpy. Feel it. It's like bumpy. <laughs> so you should sit on the toilet. <laughs> there. Ooh, what's this? Uh, he comes with a little plumber thing. See? Very good. <laughs> It's not funny. It comes with a thing I'm to plumber the toilet. It must be a poo plumber. <laughs> What's that doing there? You can lift the toilet to eat up. So that's a race car as a toilet. Yeah. Okay. Okay. And there's a piece of poo going to sit on it. Guys, you can mix and match them. The wheels. Yeah. So while he's going to the toilet, he can go anywhere. Oh no, the poop needs to go to the shop and now he has to go to the toilet. But don't worry, he can go anywhere. Can take the boot out. I'm actually quite surprised we haven't had a major Thank fight you. over this toy yet. It's been a fairly peaceful event so far. Dad, look. It's a boot riding a boot. I need a... Well, I've still got one more package to open there, and there's my three-year-old son very much enjoying this toy. Even though it's a toy for five years and plus, yeah. he's he's really keyed into this. And I've got my daughter who's eight, and she's very much enjoying this toy as well. Mm. And it's really entertained them. Underwear. Yes, <laughs> it's got some um, quite interesting themes to this toy, and that's probably why it's got such a big appeal. Yeah. Do you remember what colour is related to what series with the trash packs? 
series four, series three, series two, series one. Oh, okay. Very simple. I've just had those two things fight at me at high velocity. Thank you for that. Thank you for lots of things. But while my daughter's opening the last packet, there's an instruction manual that comes with them, and it's quite interesting. It details all how all little components go on to, well, the racer. And you can see there that the components can be swapped around onto different things because of the way they're constructed. And they've got noise. That one was called a stinking toilet. And that boot thing was called a bath boot. No wonder. And on the other side of that instruction manual, well, there's a bit of thing there, mix and match, blah, blah, blah. And there's some details on how all the small components can be fitted onto these races, even your trashies, and how to launch them. Milky. Yes, sure. No, I didn't get a little milk. Yes, sure. Sitting in this milk is like a hot bathtub. Ow. Have you got your trashy? Yep. What are you saying? Battle. Battle for choice. Battle is your dick. It's our duty. Yeah, we are gonna race. Let's see who's the fastest. We go three, away. two, one. We're gonna hit the bins. I can my turn. These are the two styled keys across the six races. Well, these toys are really great. Me and my brother love playing with them. They are so cool. I love the trashies that come with them. Up, up, yeah, he likes that. Um, they look really good and good idea for calling them like gross yep. names. Yep. I like it. We and we loved it when it said we can mix and match them. Which one's your favourite? My favourite one, the toilet one. I, I love this my one. Favorite, that. I like this one. I like the one. Three, two, one. Well, I've brought the scrap braces down to the garage because there's a few things that I'd like to do with them away from the children. And I noticed that these toys are very popular. I go to the toy shops every week and these things were running off the shelves really fast. It's quite interesting once you have a closer look at these toys, there's a lot of stuff going on. They're very brightly colored. They are very highly detailed. And they've got little bits and pieces on them that you can interchange and swap between races. So you can make a customised racer once you start mixing and marrying all the different parts together. And from what I've seen in my house, my daughter liked trash packs right from series one. She had a lot of squinkies around and it's interesting, the squinkies don't seem to have that much appeal versus these trash packs. And my daughter has desired more trash packs as the years have gone on and she's keyed into really anything that's trashy. These guys have literally sent the squinkies to the trash pile. What I'd like to do is show you just how punchy these are out of the key release. It's spring loaded once you put that in. It's interesting on this one because it's got a really short wheelbase, so it'd be a fairly unstable little racer. My daughter loves this one. There's a toilet roll there. There's a poop. She says it's poop. I don't know if that's <laughs> a bit of plumbing. But I'll show you just how fast these are. If I do it back here, not too much friction on the ground. And three, two, one, and fire. And I'll knock over a whole bunch of stuff. And I might put the slow motion camera on this so we can just see what's going on. And while we're thinking of the trash pack, there's a new trashy around, and it's called UFT, Ultimate Fighting Trashies. And I'll be taking a look at those at some time in the future. Watch out Ninja Go, you're about to be trashed. Or should I say Beyblades, it's time to go to the recycle bin.
Because sometime in your life, you're going to get trashed. I've got to hide the stuff down in the garage, because if my daughter saw it, she would go ballistic. And the other way to look at these toys is, if you're going to a children's party, and you're looking for something just a little bit different, something that's going to stand out, something that's not too expensive, something that is going to cross a fairly wide age range, these toys are perfect. And I quite often see in shops people picking this stuff up, and you hear the people saying, Oh, what are we going to get for such and such birthday? Hey, let's get some trashies. It's the perfect little gift. Well, I've come to an end of another video. I can release these toys back up into the house, and my children can trash them. Ha ha ha. No pun intended. If you've lasted this long, thank you for doing so. And I'm pretty sure we all know what comes next. Now, it's time for the fail Yay! Um, let's do that again. Fail! <laughs> what? <laughs> What's he doing? What is it? Fail! This looks fun, and this is rubbish you can race with. Let's do it! Toenails. I ain't made coke. <laughs>